It has been almost two months since Bryce Harper returned from his uh, UCL injury, and he was DHing an awful lot. But tonight, here in Cleveland, he's going to make his first ever start at first base. Gavin Williams will be our starting pitcher tonight, making his sixth start on the year. He has a one and two record, a 3.04 ERA. Swings at that pitch and lifts the fly ball to center field. Routine play for Miles Straw. One down. The next pitch, and it is swung on, lifted in the air to right. Arias cruising toward the line will grab it two down. Now the 0 2 pitch. A swing and a miss. Chase the slider that was outside, and a 10 pitch first inning for Gavin Williams. Rangers score as well. July has not been real friendly with him. Walks have been problematic. Opponents' average, average is up around 313. Well, after 1,258 games and 1,242 starts in the outfield, Bryce Harper makes his first career start at first base. And he bounces one over to first. How about that? Glove side, little flip to Ranger. They worked on it for over a month, time after time after time. And I guess uh, if there's any jitters, which Rob Thompson said there wasn't, and Bryce seemed fine today when I was talking to him at the hotel. Just a nice, easy 3-1 hookup. The pitch. And it swung on, banged up the middle of base, hit into center. Ball nearly was caught by Suarez. He looked at his glove in disbelief as the ball was banged right back up the middle. Ramirez a big jump. Naylor almost got knocked out. And Jose is safe with his 11th stolen base of the year. I mean, Naylor had to bail out in a hurry. And now the Guardians have runners at the corners with two down. A couple of infield hits. Can Josh Bell stay hot? Since the All-Star break, Josh Bell is hitting 368. A swing and a line drive. Deep left field. Off the wall. Extra bases for Bell. Into scores Ramirez. Into third is Naylor. Bell with a ringing double. High off the 19 foot wall and left. And the Guardians have a 1 0 lead. And that was a rifle shot off the bat of Josh Bell. And a smash off the glove of the shortstop Turner. That's going to get Naylor home, and Bell stops at third. And the Guardians keep the pressure on Philadelphia here in the first. Two nothing Cleveland. Well, that's a backhand I think that uh, Turner should have made. Should have made that play. He got off the side, and he, he just reached for the ball more than he oh, had to. Arch. Well, Straw will lead things off. Miles Straw, 243, no home runs. There's a liner over to first and down to his knees. Bryce Harper snags it. Hot shot. There's out did. number one as Miles Straw lines out to Harper. Are you keeping a checklist with that ground ball, line drive? Boy, that was a bullet right at his head. No problem. Good job getting his hands up in front of his face. Trey Turner, who flied out to right field his first time up. Line drive out to left center field. That's going to be in for a base hit. And Quan can't run it down. It's going to allow Turner to turn at second base and head on toward third. The throw won't be made by Rosario. It's going to be a triple for Trey Turner, his fourth of the year. Yeah, I'm really surprised that Miles Straw didn't actually track this down. I don't know why he left his feet. Maybe, maybe he thought he could stop him from being at second base. But here's the pitch, and he swings and grounds it to short. It'll get the run home. Rosario gobbles it up throws to first Castellanos picks up the RBI and cuts the lead in half it's now two to one two to one Cleveland bottom of the third Ahmed Rosario rounded out his first time up Rosario pops it up outside of first Harper is over and jumps and he makes <laughs> oh the catch God. oh my goodness that is unbelievable and everybody held their breath for a moment he is just absolutely remarkable sometimes. He is. I mean, this guy is almost inhuman. He's like a cyborg. I mean, he just decided, you know what? I'm going to go catch this baseball. It doesn't matter how or in what fashion. He's amazing. Sometimes he really is amazing. The Phils have two more base runners here in the fourth, and Jake Cave will have another opportunity. Here's the pitch, and it's swung on, line near the middle, past the diving shortstop Rosario. It's into center. Rounding third, heading for home is Bohm, the throw by Straw. In time at the plate. He got him at home plate. Another tremendous throw from Miles Straw cuts down a run, and the Guardians remain in the lead. And that's going to lower the bases for Trey Turner. Line drive center field. Miles Straw makes the catch. Hit it hard. But Trey Turner slams the helmet in frustration as the Phillies leave him loaded for the second time tonight. 
He slugs this one deep left field. Back is Kay looking up. It's off the wall. And hustling towards second base, David Fry headlong in there, and he just does beat the tag for a leadoff double. Made it close at second, but he's in there. Got the hand in, his third double, leadoff double. Take advantage of it, boys. Stephen Kwan coming to the plate. Kwan is 0 for 2. He has bounced to first and struck out. And a line drive base hit right field. Fry scores. Arias stops at second. And the Guardians lead is 3 to 1 as Stephen Kwan picks up. His 32nd run batted in on the year. I'll tell you what, nice piece of hitting. Quan finds the hole between first and second. Now he's got to deal with David Fry, who's two for two and doubled off the wall his last time up. And that's a fair ball behind the back at third. Boom. Made a great play and gets the force at second. Wow. For out number two, a run scores. It's 4 1 Cleveland, but boom. What he a play. really picked his pitcher up big time right there. That is a uh, that's a just a terrific play a big league play. It's fair ball and he stumbles but he still makes a good throw to get Bell at second base. Philly's trying to get something going offensively. They've got the bases loaded for the third time and they've got Kyle Schwarber up with one out. And it's high ball four and he walks three straight batters all of them left handed as Schwarber picks up the RBI. It's his 60th of the season. Swing and a miss. He got him to go fish. Oh, a huge strikeout for Nick Sandlin. Two down in the inning. Here's the pitch. And it's swung on, hit in the air. Shallow left. Coming in is Quan. Makes a catch. What a job by Sandlin. Top of the order, Stephen Quan. One for three, an RBI single. Slaps it. Fair ball over the bag at third. Straw on his way to third base. Cave cuts it off into second with a double is Stephen Quan. And the Guardians are set up. Second time tonight, Phillies have the infield in, but Bohm, the third baseman, plays a few steps back at third. Here's the 3 1 pitch. Swung on, line drive, base hit in the left. That'll score Straw. Quan stops at third. Throw goes all the way to the plate, but the Guardians have taken it to a 5 to 2 lead. And there's a ground ball up the middle, backhanded and misplayed by Stott. Another run is in. Quan comes home from third. The Guardians pick up their second run of the inning, and it's 6-2 Cleveland. Stott's a pretty good defender, and it almost looked like he kind of nonchalanted that. Here's JT Riomuto, 0 for 3, righty-righty matchup. That ball's hit well out to left field. Going back on it is Quan. It is gone! A two run home run for JT. Well, the Phillies do climb closer. It's now a 6 4 ball game. That's his 12th home run of the year. And yeah, that's really nice to see. JT's been struggling a little bit getting that foot down and getting that timing. The windup of the 0 2 pitch. Stott swings, hits one deep right field. Going back on it and looking up, and that is gone. And Bryson Stott goes back to back with JT Real Muto. And for Bryson, it's number nine on the season, and it's a one-run game all of a sudden, six to five, Cleveland. Blase, 25 saves on the year, and he'll have the four, five, and six hitters due up for Philadelphia. Swung on, chopper up the middle, behind second, Rosario gloves, throws, ball game! And the Guardians have beaten the Phillies in game one of this weekend series by a final score of six to five.